and we are live hey everyone uh, good tuesday morning to you all i am fizan uh, and i am here with my special colleague sami for most valuable builder force session uh, that awaits you yes you heard it right if you are a developer and wanted to build on vsc also by this exciting initiative we have benefits to offer which will be cover next so thanks again everyone for tuning in now let's get it started sami sir over to you thanks a lot faizan um hello everyone thanks for joining us uh we're on this sharing session i'm going to be sharing some more information about the most valuable builder program so we launched in early january the fourth iteration of the most valuable builder program so uh, to give you a high level overview the we launched the most valuable builder program as a um as a way to provide various types of support for uh, developers and project teams that are building projects in the finance smart chain uh, ecosystem uh, so we've launched the fourth cohort so basically where uh, each cohort has a, a start and a, a end date um, and in which uh, we're selecting projects based on certain criteria um, as the best performing projects based on the product development and user traction as well as other criteria which I'll share more information about and for uh, selected projects providing uh, several financial as well as non-financial benefits um, so getting into what uh the uh, mvb program is more about so uh covering some of the key uh success stories and achievements of the mvb program so far uh so there's been over 1000 projects applied to the mvb program since the first cohort um many of those projects have had uh uh very significant growth Uh, during their participation in the MVP program and uh, being supported with uh, marketing as well as other types of support that they have uh, received from the MVP participation. Uh, so to share some data points, there's been over 500,000 daily active addresses as well as over 50% of daily transaction volumes on BSC at, at different points in time have been contributed from the MVP to uh, top 20 projects specifically. Um, many of the participating projects also achieved over 10 times growth on daily active users as well as transaction volumes in the MVP GameFi projects. Some of the very noticeable and notable uh, success stories such as Auto Farm Beefy, Alpaca, Mobox, and Tranches, uh, which were uh, previous MVP winners, achieved listings on Binance.com. Um, and we've also seen all-time high daily transaction uh, volumes of 13, above 13.17 million transactions on BSC and uh, over 1.3, uh, now it's closer to 2 million, over 2 million daily active users. Uh, which is significantly higher than the respective data points on the Ethereum mainnet. So the main idea around uh, MVP4 is the, the, the key theme is around MetaFi. Uh, so I think a lot of you might be wondering what MetaFi really is. So MetaFi is really convergence of several areas. So one is Web3 infrastructure and specifically looking at how Uh, to scale Web3 infrastructure to meet the needs of MetaFi use cases. Uh, so there are a number of different areas uh, um, and use cases when that are covered by MetaFi. These include Metaverse, gaming and GameFi projects, as well as SocialFi projects and use cases. Um, another key component of those are that a lot of these projects, whether it's in the Metaverse space or gaming, or GameFi projects or, or SocialFi projects will leverage some type of DeFi Legos or DeFi infrastructure uh, on which these projects are built on top. Um, 
So to summarize, three key areas where the MVB4 is focused on. Uh, Web3 infrastructure, uh, advanced DeFi Legos, as well as uh, projects building uh, in the metaverse, GameFi, and SocialFi domains. Um, so all of these holistically are categorized as uh, MetaFi. So that's the main theme for the MVB focus. And of course, we've seen recently a lot of um, attention in the mainstream media as well as in, in the crypto space around MetaFi, a lot of uh, uh, newsworthy events, uh, including Facebook, for example, renaming themselves to Meta, which has really driven a lot of interest around uh, the possibilities and opportunities around Metaverse and, and MetaFi. Um, so that's the key, uh, the, the key focus for the MVB4 program. So highly encourage projects that are building uh, infrastructure projects in any of these areas uh, on the BSC infrastructure to uh, enroll in the MVB4 program. Uh, so a high-level timeline of what MVB4, uh, the roadmap looks like. So the registrations for projects started in January, but will continue until uh, April 2022. So highly encourage any projects, regardless of which stage of development the, the project is. So even if it's in uh, kind of early ideation stages or you're actively developing the product, or if the product is uh, launched or and, and in different stages of uh, its growth, um, encourage, still encourage project teams to uh, uh, register in the MVP regardless of the stage of your current project. So it's an online registration process. You can find more details about how to do the registration from uh, our blog. So uh, you can find our blog on um, finance.org. And there you'll find a link to our blog. In the blog, you'll find a blog post about the MVB4, which has more comprehensive details about what you could expect, as well as importantly, uh, the registration information. So uh, at a high level, the registration process looks like uh, submitting some information about the projects, as well as um, registering the smart contracts of your project uh, in a specific process. Um, so after the registration process, we're also conducting some initial evaluations about projects based on the information submitted and selecting projects for incubation. Um, so even in, and in case your project is not selected for incubation, don't worry, uh, you'll still have plenty of other opportunities to stand out from others and demonstrate uh, the um, the, demonstrate your project and ability um, on the product development as well as user acquisition around how useful your products are. Um, throughout the program, so in each month from January uh, through to March, so in January and February and March, in each of the months, we'll be selecting monthly stars. So those are projects that have uh, stood out from the, uh, their peers in, in various criteria. So the BSC Growth Fund team will conduct uh, evaluation on each of the products uh, covering uh, several criteria. So the team and track record, the product, like what is the problem that the project is trying to solve, um, the product design, uh, as well as the development uh, capabilities, so the execution quality of the product development, and then also looking at the execution quality of user acquisition for products that are at that stage. Um, and then based on these criteria, the BSC Growth Fund team will, will be selecting um, a monthly stars, which will receive uh, multiple financial as well as non-financial benefits. Um, and then, so the monthly star selection will happen uh, three times. So it will happen in January, it will happen in, in February, and then the third time will be in, in, in March. Um, and then uh, in the final phase, we the top players among all the MVB projects will be selected. 
So the MVB committee, which I'll share a little bit more details about what the MVB committee is, will select up to three projects from the previous, previously selected monthly star projects to be uh, selected as the MVB four top players. So those are the, the top winners, the, the ones that will receive the, the highest level of prizes as well as support through being selected as top players from the MVB four program. So that's the high level roadmap and the timeline timelines for what to expect from the MVP4 program. To go into a little bit more details about the, the benefits, um, so for the monthly stars, monthly stars will be uh, selected every month, as mentioned, and will receive investment offers from the BSC Growth Fund. Uh, they will also uh, be invited to participate in the MVP incubation program and where they get access to uh, excellent network of uh, experts and mentors to help support and accelerate the growth of their products and projects. The monthly star projects will also receive marketing and community support in the VSC uh, regional and global um, uh, social media properties, as well as uh, community channels such as our the uh, BSC community Telegram. Uh, groups as well as Discord uh, channels. Uh, the monthly stars also receive support uh, from the security perspective. So this includes um, from auditing and as well as other security uh, security community partners. Uh, so this could look like uh, improved mobilization time for audits. So for monthly star projects, instead of having to wait that like sometimes longer periods of time for security audit mobilization, um, the, um, the MVP program will help to accelerate those uh, and shorten those mobilization times, um, as well as uh, the opportunity for monthly star, star projects to be invited to the Binance Labs in incubation program. Uh, so that's a, a high level of the benefits that will be received by monthly star projects. But for the top players, the final uh, selection round, um, the top players are selected from the monthly star. So the top players will receive uh, follow on investment offers. So the first place will receive up to $1 million um, of investment and the second place will receive 500k and the third place will receive 200k. Uh, the top players will also receive uh, transaction fee uh, sub, uh, support. So this could look like a transaction fee subsidy uh, or a similar structure. The top players also received enhanced marketing and community support and are also importantly uh, prioritized for listing reviews on Binance.com, as well as receiving um, ongoing technology, technology support. So a lot of amazing benefits for the MVP4 program, monthly stars, as well as for the top players. So highly recommend project teams if they haven't already to go ahead and register for the MVP4. Um, I touched upon the MVB committee previously. So the MVB community, uh, the MVB committee is uh, composed of key uh, institutional partners in uh, the BSC uh, ecosystem. These include uh, professional market makers, um, uh, crypto venture capital firms, uh, technology partners. Um, as well as members from the security com committee uh, specifically certain. Um, so the idea of the MVP committee is to uh, provide more decentralization as well as transparency around the, the uh, monthly stars and, and finally the top, uh, the top player selection process. The um, also want to conclude by mentioning uh, that Dora Hacks is one of our key partners in the MVB program, so helping on 
uh, incubation as well as other events that are happening as part of the MVB collaboration. So look out for more uh, information and announcements about our ongoing collaboration and events supported by Dora Hacks. No, thanks, Sami, sir, for letting our uh, audience through this uh, uh, MVP4 program and the benefits that we are here to offer to those who are building exciting applications on BSC. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. I think thanks, everyone, for listening uh, uh, and tuning in from wherever you are. And before we end, let me remind quickly Indian developers community, especially, uh, that we would like to have you uh, on board by this program. Uh, but this initiative MVB4, if you are building some cool applications on BSE. Yeah, thanks a lot, Faisal. I highly encourage all the developers and project teams to uh, register their projects in the MVB4 program. Uh, yeah, thank, thank you, guys you so much for joining in. Thanks. Bye bye for now. Thanks. Bye.